This is Queen's Daughters Hall, built in the 1890s as a residential home. We just opened this as the new visitor center this year. A student can register for their visit online um, and download an app that allows them to check in and that will let us know that they're here or nearby campus so that we can greet them as soon as they walk in. After you've completed your admission presentation, you can go and you can take advantage of the many technologies we have in the office. We have a puffer sphere that has all the countries where our students come from, and you can also see the different study abroad programs. We have an interactive table with different photos of campus, and then also you can take uh, advantage of the photo booth that we have with a computerized background, and then you're greeted by an ambassador afterwards and you begin your tour. So the next step in the campus visit is our campus tour. We want a prospective student to be able to look at our campus and say, can I see myself here? I know that I need quiet study time. I see places to do that. Or I know I do better in a group study. Here's the best residence hall for me for that kind of experience. We don't have a scripted tour, so we want to make sure that we show students these personal stories as they go on the tour. For the student that really has the more specific questions and needs the more personal attention, we are so lucky to have this space to give that to them.